Uh, g'day guys, this is a, uh, another video about the 2008 Range Rover Sport EGR cooler. Very quick video, so we've had one EGR cooler fail uh, and pump copious amounts of coolant into the exhaust. And uh, simultaneously there was another one fail. So I know it's hard to believe, I know, <laughs> but the amount of coolant that was coming out of it um, and it happened one morning a few we a week ago. The amount of coolant led me to think it was two. Anyway, all the dealers in Australia like, we've never heard of it. Uh, they never go. There's plenty of them secondhand. So the owner chose secondhand. Lo and behold, I did this side. And now, and now this side is pumping coolant into the exhaust. Now, by clamping off this hose, and this hose, you can eliminate the driver's side EGR cooler or passenger side, sorry, in, uh, in Australia. And the reason um, I've cut this hose, I'll tell you why I've cut the hose. So I didn't want to cut the hose. I wanted to use my own heater hose, but it's going to hit the water pump. The, the uh, genuine hose has a unique bend in it. And here's the bend right here. Okay, so I know it's not nice, but that's what's gonna happen to this car and I will release it from my workshop. Okay, now, on top of it, his EGRs have been blanked anyway. So, like, I was trying to do the right thing, but uh, obviously the car uh, wants a uh, uh, war with me. Uh, I immediately clamped off with four good clamps, this hose and this hose. They are the feed and return from the EGR to the heating system here. You can see I've pulled the shrouds off and that to do this. And I've tried to put my own hoses over there to preserve these hoses so one day someone can return it back to how it was born. But no, there is a unique bend in the hose. Now, you can see this hose is missing a clip or a screw by someone who probably did the timing belt but regardless even if I install that screw I will not be able to clear the water pump and even if I use this existing clip down here to secure the hose so anyway once I start the car I'll make another video but for now I've cut the end off this EGR uh, pipe smoothed it off I'll clean that up a little bit better and this will then go in here so a um, this heater hose will actually, uh, this 5.8 diameter heater hose fits quite nicely on that side, but it will not fit here because the hose is wider. Um, of course, you know, I could have done this. That, that's, that's actually, um, oh, okay. Well, it's too late now, I've cut the hose. So that would have been a quicker solution. If you want to gamble with this hose and come up with something like that, that would work, but still, um, it's over now. Um, and in the event that this hose needs to be reconnected one day, I can put a T in there and reconnect it. So, okay, guys, hope it helps, babe.